Hey folks, it's me, Denny Milmil, here to fulfill a promise I made on Twatter. I mean, what's up with that site, huh? Cha-chas? 280. I haven't seen that many characters in one place since Bobby Altman died. On Sunday, I tweeted, what a horrid human being Michelle Wolf is. I'm going to read up on her over the next couple of days, and we'll have a few brutally mean jokes about her by Wednesday. Well, it's Wednesday. <laughs> and I wrote four whole jokes. So buckle up, Cheechels, because these Shelly Wolf zings will make you spit out your sanka. Number one, what's with Michelle Wolf's hair? Sorry, babe, but I don't take my Swifty and finger wagging from a tonsorial disciple of Mick Hucknall. I'll really piss off the ginger contingent. <laughs> Number two, let's get a star to host this thing, huh? Expecting a famous comedian and getting Michelle Wolf is like expecting Magnum P.I. and getting Matt Houston. Sorry, chimichangas, but the only Lee Horsley vehicle I'm interested in is his 78 Chevette. So roomy. <laughs> Number three, eradicate Islam. Number four, hey, wealthy, your voice sounds a little shrill, chooch, booch. I haven't been ear-fucked that hard since Mike met the mechanics. If I had a hankering for the dulcet tones of Shelley Duvall to the Gene Stapleton's power, I'd just toss a helium balloon to Marion Ramsey. Marion Ramsey. So there you have it, Michelle. A blistering, lightning-fast takedown times quattro. How do you like them manzanas, chachi? Scott Baio, good friend of mine, nice guy. I like where his hair's at. Well, guess what, folks? That's the smug, insufferable horseshit, and I am out of here. Greg Evigan.